when he spoke about Sakwabie. And people have just cut this Chinese part to throw black rasta. But if you should listen to the full breakdown of the full song now, you know that the song is preaching a different message from what people are portraying the song to be. So this is Black Rasta and Ja Amba. Yes, the two of them on the same song. The title of the song is Our Africa. And we are coming to break down this song to see whether the Tai Chi Chi Chai Cho is actually foolish lyrics or the whole song is sensible. I'm the headless YouTuber that's headless your actions. I'm the There is a new African in the world. Okay. That new African is ready to fight his own battle. And after all, the black man is capable of managing his own affairs. I don't got a king sat up on a throne of Ethiopia. Drew the remarks of a hadar to a zoom. Salam na Greetings. Black Rasa Lams and Jamba. when it comes to reggae and all that you know. so yes now he featured Ja Amba listen to the words Yanko 400 years 100 millions and many more we were back like fish in a cannon shifted on guinea shores yeah. they took black magic and Ashanti's golden stool oh yes we worked the plantations and never get no pay Africa, Africa, Africa is for us. This is the time that we we need to know ourselves. We need to know our history and we need to know ourselves and you know self-liberation and stuff like that. Africa is ours. Now this song was released nine years ago. Nine years ago. But it is now because of this whole Sakodia issue that this song has resurfaced. Now, the question is, for this song to resurface after nine years because of what Black Rasta has said about Sarkodie, no? was it a good thing for him to attack Sarkodie like that or bad? Because right now it's like, it's to his advantage. Hmm. I don't understand why people attack other artists. <laughs> <laughs> yes, without any mystery is like a tree with a root that kind of tree could never bear no fruit mama africa before we dance abroad we got to learn to dance a yard divide and rule could only tear us apart the time has come for i and night to i night hakuna matata make we stop all the fight been through the struggle and washed down the drain so much agony and so much pain oh children sing now he's saying that a country without a mystery is like a tree without no fruit uh, no roots it can't bear any fruit and divide and conquer is what to worry us so we need to come together we need to unite as africa to come together and fight a common cause to liberate ourselves to raise ourselves and all that this is a deep song now let's wait and see whether Black Rasta will spoil the song or he <laughs> Africa in a riot Africa in a riot Africa in a riot Yo, uh -huh. as a people We was lived in peace and harmony The wicked pale face man ransacked the rank and file with anarchy Papa was slaughtered like a goat in a butchery. Mama was raped like a whore in total misery. Bumaye, Bumaya. Bumaye, Bumaya. Chase them out cause them too filthy. Ma okay, so he's saying that once upon a time we lived in, in harmony until the pale faced man, which is like, yes, the Ebony, 
I came and ransacked all of them, killed the men, raped the women, stuff like that. But so, Bumaye, Bumaya, we need to chase them out of here because what? They, they, are, they are bad vibes. So we need to chase them and they're chasing, no? With the, whether it's gun or whatever, it's violence. Bumaye, Bumaya. <laughs> Cause them too filthy. Mabrak, 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 Mabrak. Strike them out just like them cause a blasphemy. Them desecrated the holy lands at Timbuktu, Lalibela, Duri Gaga, Gaga, Duri. Chase them out, out of Duri Gaga, Gaga, Duri, Duri Gaga, Gaga, Duri, Duri, Gaga, Gaga, Duri. Hey, what is this Gaga, Duri, Duri, Gaga? <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. So he's calling on the gods of Tanda or whoever. To strike all these people out of Africa because they desecrated the holy lands of Ethiopia, of you know Timbuktu, and all those places. So they need to be chased out. Gaga do ri do gaga. Anchor, Missy Wangwano, now our Biomo. In Africa, we sit on gold, yet we never gain. Yeah, man, we sit on diamond, yet we go through pain. Dirty Chinese man, thief with diamond, gold and tin, and only laugh and drink champagne. Now he started by saying we should run away because the people have come back again. The people who came earlier in the 1400th and 15th, 16th year to come and enslave us. They've come back again, so we should run away because now we are sitting on gold and we are not seeing gold. We are not chopping the gold sun. Hey, <laughs> Yanko. Gold and tin, and only laugh and drink champagne. Our misleaders who say that we lead us, only betray we and feel no shame. Mm. African people are eating more Chinese food now than Tiobo Don Plantain. Our misleaders who think they are our leaders, no? They don't have any clue. So they are leading us or misleading us into, into our graves. Now, these people are taking our minerals from the land and they are using it to, you can say, they are using it to get a, themselves rich and build Chinese restaurants and Chinese companies here in our motherland. <laughs> and now the indigents are eating more Chinese food than we are eating, but than we are eating our local food. <laughs> yeah, I'm Shiny man gone down with indigents, just like them one insane. Here, everywhere you go now, black people put on as cheap Chinese imitation like sugar cane. No wonder now, the ch imitation like sugar cane. Okay, okay, so right now he's saying that everywhere you go, the black man um, consumes the Chinese imitation. This is supposed to be Dochi and Gabbana, but right now it's Docha and. <laughs> <laughs> No wonder now the churches in Africa sing Chinese hymns and I am up to you. Tai Chi, Tai Cho, PCI, Shepherd, Tai Ming Chi, Tai Cho, Cho Chi Chi, PCI, Shepherd, Ching Chang Ku, Tai Ming Ku, Now you see where the Chinese came from. So now you see where the Chinese came from. That right now, because we are consuming Chinese food and Chinese everything, if you go to the churches, they are singing Chinese hymns. Like all these tongues and things, you know. It sounds like Chinese. Chai chi, chi, chai cho, chi fu ya, chi fu. This is Black Rasta's EU. It may sound funny, but the message is deep. The message is deeper than all the other songs that sound serious. So, um, judging from this, would you say Black uh, Black Rasta does foolish music? Or you think it's just a misconception because um, some little part of the song was, you know, pushed out for propaganda? Let me know your views, whether your perspective on Black Rasta's music has changed or not. Let me know. Yan <laughs> Trolling black.
cluster a lot. And now that you've seen or you've taken your time to listen to the song, I know a lot of people who would never listen to this song on a regular day. They would never. Some people are not opening themselves, themselves up to um, experience new things or to learn new things. That's why I did this breakdown. Let's see whether your perspective about Black Rasta's music will change. And sometimes when someone brings out a clip or a little portion of something, try your best to personally do some research and find out the full picture before you judge. Because the show from what that, that was trending, it made it seem like Black Rasta is some unserious guy. But if you listen to this song, you can see that he is preaching positive. Now let me know what you think about this song. Let me know what you think about Black Rasta now. And <laughs> the way he attacked, please, Black Rasta, the fact that your songs are trending again because of what you said, doesn't mean you should go and do more. Leave Star Kodia and the other people alone. The song that the Mali and uh, Bob Mali's family has done, no? they know why they did it. Stop the tagging and all that. Thank you. And I don't know, watch other videos on this channel. Tell somebody about Headless. Yeah,